Hi everyone, I'm Glenda Payton. I live in Houston, Texas, and I work for the Aleph Independent School District, and I've been there 25 years. Amen. 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 Amos. One more time. Me. Oh. Amos and Penny. I'm going to get it from Amos. I'm going to give it to you. I know it's protocol, but I'm going to let Amos go last. Class, I have to say this, uh, and I don't know if he's going to do it, but in order for this to come into existence, and we all are in this building, this is, uh, uh, how can I say it? Something God ordained. Amen. Because you just this just don't happen. I, I looked around last night, and I think if we would have counted, we had the biggest class there. We had the largest group there. And then you can look at this group even tonight and say it has to be a reason why we continue to be on one accord. And I think that we should never, ever let our bond be broken as a group. Whether you graduated March, we realized that you started that journey with us, and we are forever grateful that you did it. I'm going to turn the mic over, but I have to say this. Amos Spikes, Ms. Larsen Nichols Spikes worked so hard to bring this to a group issue. It was so amazing. He deserves that applause plus much, much more. He spent, spent time, energy, money, on calls, conversation, but he did not throw in the towel, even the programs he left them, but he got us a program anyway. He is a go-getter. If you get an opportunity tonight, please pay, pay homage to Amos. He deserves it. And then on behalf of you, and I'm through, because Trussell is grunting, uh, you paid your money, true enough, but someone had to plan how to spend that money. That all goes to Amos. Let's give them a round of applause. Actually, it's we, not I. That's what he said. We, all, we always come together and do things and help each other out. Before we go to the prayer, there's one thing I want to do. Is uh, We got a person in our class that have been really, all of them have been blessed, but this person has been a real blessing. You know, it's a blessing to be a parent. No matter how tough things got, we still were blessed to have a parent. Right. If it was just one parent. But to share the pain with a child, even that child not yours, or those children, right. it's surely a blessing. Amen. And I think uh, that we all have to notify how sweet it is to have someone that come into a child's life, a children's life. So, uh, Ms. Jenny Smith, you come forward, please. All right, Ms. Pooch. Come on. 